Hello people, welcome to my channel, welcome to another video, this is my reaction video for the match that will be taking place shortly at Stamford Bridge in the Premier League between Chelsea and Sheffield United and I will of course be kicking it off by giving you guys my team sheet reaction and in terms of my team sheet reaction I will start off by giving you guys the Chelsea starting 11, I will then be giving you guys the Sheffield United starting 11, I will be giving you guys the two benches in the exact same order and lastly I will be giving you guys a recap of the two starting 11s so getting straight into it and as always starting off with the formation for Chelsea um, it is a 4-3-3 and in terms of the personnel Frank Lampard has chosen he's gone with Edouard Mendy in goal he's gone with a back four from right to left of Rhys James, Kurt Zuma, Thiago Silva and Ben Chilwell he's gone with a midfield three of N'Golo Kante, Mason Mount and Mateo Kovacic with a front three from right to left of Hakim Ziyech, Tammy Abraham and Timo Werner. Now for the Sheffield United first team, um, guys I don't know all the names, I don't know all, all of their first names so I'm just going to read out their surnames. Um, they've gone with their usual 3-5-2 and they've gone with Ramsdale and goal, they've gone with a back three of Basham, Egan and Stevens. they've gone with a midfield five including the wing backs from right to left of Bulldog, Bolin Berg, or Berge, however you pronounce that, Norwood, Lundstrom and Lowe, and they've gone with a front two of Brewster and McGoldrick. Now for the two benches, starting off with the Chelsea bench, um, and Frank Lampard has placed Antonio Rudiger, Jorginho, Willy Caballero, Olivier Giroud, Callum hudson odoi Cesar Azpilicueta and Emerson Palmieri on the bench for the Blues, and Chris Wilder has placed Oli McBurney, Billy Sharp, Oliver Burke, Phil Jagielka, um, Robinson, Verips and Osborne, I don't know all the first names of their players like I've said, but that's who Chris Wilder has placed on the bench for the Blades. And now for the recap of the two starting 11s. Starting off with the Chelsea, um, starting off with the Chelsea starting 11, um, 4 3 3 for us, Edouard Mendy and goal, a back four from right to left of Reese James, Kurt Zuma, Thiago Silva, and Ben Chilwell, a midfield three of N'Golo Kante, Mason Mount, and Mateo Kovacic, with a front three from right to left of Hakim Ziyech, Tammy Abraham, and Timo Werner. Now for the Sheffield United team again, it's a 3 5 2 for them as we all expected. Um, Ramsdale and goal, a back three of Basham, Egan and Stevens, a midfield five including the wing backs from right to left of Bulldog, Bolin Berg or Burge again, I don't know how to pronounce that, um, Norwood, Lundstrom and Lowe and a striking partnership of Brewster and McGoldrick. Two strong teams, I do think that the team in which we've um, put, put out to start the game should be strong enough to get the job done but I'm not counting my chickens, I, I wouldn't be surprised if Sheffield United scored a goal and caused us problems because they are a good side and we cannot we cannot underestimate them. But anyways, that is it for this part of this reaction video and I hope you all enjoy the rest of this reaction video. Come on Chelsea, let's beat the Blades. Come on. has just begun come on you blues just get the job done against the blades and score some good goals come on Chelsea it's Chelsea nil it's Sheffield United one David McGoldrick scores his third goal against us in um, two games or in the last two games shall I say for Sheffield United and it is a great goal it was a well-worked corner however I have to say that it was poorly defended um, I don't know what the players in the box were doing um, the players who tried to press the ball did the right thing, but um, the ball still got to David McGoldrick in the middle of the box. And yeah, we fall behind. And I'm not going to lie to you guys, Sheffield United have had the better start of the two sides. But yes, they lead by one goal to nil. Not a good start from Chelsea. Almost 19 minutes have been played and we really have struggled to get going in this first half so far. And... It's not looking good. It's Chelsea 1, it's Sheffield United 1. Tammy Abraham gets his third goal against the um against the Blades. I almost forgot their nickname there. In as many appearances against them for the Blues. And it was a great team goal, I have to say. It started off with Hakim Ziyech putting the ball over the top towards Mateo Kovacic, who ran into the half space. 
and he saw that um, Tammy Abraham was in loads of space um, towards the edge of the box and Tammy Abraham just fired it into the bottom left corner on his side and hopefully this um, helps us get into our rhythm because this really hasn't been a great first half performance so far but a great goal. It's 1-1. Um, Chelsea have won themselves a free kick in the right wing position. I'm not sure who will be taking it, but it would be nice if we could get a goal from this. Come on. Hakim Ziyech takes the free kick and he whips it into the box with his dominant left foot. And it evades pretty much everyone in the box except the goalkeeper. And the goalkeeper parries it out towards the left hand side of the box, which is where Timo Werner was standing at the time in which... The free kick was taken by Hakim Ziyech, it falls to Timo Werner and um, he fires the ball towards goal but he could only hit the bar. Very, very, very unlucky um, from Timo Werner but it was a great, it was a great cross from um, Hakim Ziyech. Chelsea have won themselves a corner on the right hand side which I believe Hakim Ziyech will be taking. Um, I'm not entirely sure if he'll be taking it but I just hope that we make the most of it and get a goal before half time. Um, come on. Yes, it's Chelsea 2, it's Sheffield United 1, Ben Chilwell scores his second Premier League goal for the Blues, and I have to say this was a great cross from the right hand side, I'm not entirely sure who whipped it in, but it was a fantastic cross, it evades everyone in the box, and... Ben Chilwell was just there at the far post and he just taps it in and yes, Chelsea have the lead. Great goal. It's Chelsea 2, it's Sheffield United 1. Come on. Mason Mount has won Chelsea another corner but this time it will be taken from the left hand side and there are less than 7 minutes plus additional time left at the end of the first half. Can we get a third goal? Hopefully, it would be nice if we could score another goal before half time but come on Chelsea, just make the most of this. Come on. Tammy Abraham forces a save from Aaron Ramsdale from the corner and I'm not going to lie to you guys, the ball did take a while to come down um, but we have another corner. We are into two added minutes at the end of the first half. It's half time, it's Chelsea 2, it's Sheffield United 1. Overall a decent first half performance from the Blues. It was a slow start, but we grew into the game, and I do think that our passing started to get a lot quicker as the half went on, which is great to see. But yes, Chelsea go into the half-time interval with a 2-1 lead, and I will see you all very soon for the second half. The second half has just begun. Come on, you Blues, score some more goals, and finish these lot off. Come on Chelsea, come on. Mateo Kovacic has won Chelsea another corner which will be taken by Mason Mount on the right hand side. Hopefully we make the most of it. The corner comes to nothing and Sheffield United did try to hit us on the counter attack but we did defend it really well and Chelsea are in possession of the ball as I speak right now. Hakim Ziyech has a chance to double Chelsea's lead from outside the box after Tammy Abraham passed the ball to him um, from the edge of the box and the defender has the ball out for a corner which Hakim Ziyech will be taking himself. Make the most of it, come on. Hakim Ziyech whips the ball in from the left hand side and it did cause a great deal of problems for the Sheffield United defence. Um, they did end up clearing the ball in the end but one of their players went down injured Tammy Abraham did have a chance to get his brace, um, but Ender Stevens got in the way and he did go down injured. Thankfully he's okay now, but it's unlucky because it was a great corner from Hakim Ziyech and some good play from the players involved in, in the chance. But yes, um, more of that please. Just over 63 minutes have been played and Hakim Ziyech has won Chelsea another free kick in a very dangerous position. Rhys James takes the free kick and forces a save from Aaron Ramsdale. It was a well-struck um, free kick. Um, unlucky for Rhys James, unlucky. Mateo Kovacic has a chance to double Chelsea's lead from outside the box. Um, it was a very good strike. It went just past the post. 
Um, the keeper looked as though he was beaten, but yes, um, it's still Chelsea 2, Sheffield United 1, and Chelsea are continuing to put pressure on Sheffield United's defence, which is great to see. I can sense a goal coming soon. Chelsea's first substitution of the match sees Mateo Kovacic go off for Jorginho due to a leg injury. I'm not entirely sure what the leg injury is. He did receive some treatment, but he had to go off because he couldn't play on. It's a shame because Mateo Kovacic was having a really good game up to the point in which he got injured. But yes, Jorginho has come on as his replacement. It's Chelsea 3, it's Sheffield United 1, Thiago Silva scores his first ever goal for the Blues and what a great goal this was. It came from a free kick which was taken by Hakim Ziyech. What a beautiful cross it was. Thiago Silva met the ball really well and just headed it past Aaron Ramsdale into the far corner. Great goal and a much, de a, a much deserved goal because we've been by far the better team in the second half so far. And yes, Chelsea have a bit of daylight now. It's Chelsea 3, it's Sheffield United 1. Come on. It's Chelsea 4, it's Sheffield United 1, Timo Werner scores yet another Premier League goal for us and this one was a gift because it did arise from a Sheffield United mistake at the back and Timo Werner just got onto the ball, he ran towards goal and just fired it past Aaron, Ram Aaron Ramsdale who had absolutely no chance of saving it and with the way you've been playing in the second half no one can say that we don't deserve this lead because, like I've said already, we've been by far the better team in the second half. Sheffield United have rarely threatened us and it's, 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 this is good. I can't even speak. I'm loving this. It's Chelsea 4, it's Sheffield United 1. There are less than 9 minutes plus additional time left at the end of the match. <sighs> Chelsea's second substitution of the match sees Timo Werner go off for Olivier Giroud. We are into three added minutes at the end of the match. It's full time, the final score is Chelsea 4, Sheffield United 1. Dominant display from the Blues and a thoroughly deserved win. We were by far the better side in the end and we could have had more. But yes, I will see you all very soon for my review.